Hello. I look like a crisp packet. What the heck is Pew! Like a sexy corporate work shirt. You know like summer's here and you want to be that woman in the office like hello boss. I'm not mad at that. I'm not mad at that at all. This is give me Grandma Doris. Grandma Doris on holiday. You know when you're like come on. Come on, that's all right. And I think you can do this up as well. I, I mean, this is taking it to grandma status though. It went from, all right, sexy secretary to Aunt Doris. I wonder if it was meant to have short arms or do I just have particularly long arms? <laughs> Not a good look. It's kind of hanging, there's a lot of space between vag and crotch. So it kind of gives you that kind of diaper, diaper thing there. This is what my husband calls the move test. It looks like a fireman's uniform. I don't know what. This is ridiculous. You need to be long or you need to be short, okay? I'm liking my middle-aged housewife top. Why do I like it? This has to stop. Do you ever feel like when you buy something that like you're like, what was I thinking? I really thought I was in the wild, wild west. Like, what? You guys know I'm too shaped. From the front, I just go like a rectangle. But I feel like this bit is doing a little bit of snatch. Let's just rock this hoodie, people. Yes! They look nice and they're not giving you like that camel toe fold exposure thing that you sometimes get at the crotch. Jeez. I'm not even, I'm not gonna wear it. I'm actually not even gonna wear it. <laughs> this is just giving me bronze sack. Flap your wings, okay, flap your wings. This is kind of giving me a bit of Little house on the prairie. One wrong slip and it's over. It's completely and utterly over. You are just a nipple away from your tea. This is giving me bondage. Bondage! Well, I need a little whip right now, you know. I feel like zipped up. I look like a stuffed turkey. <laughs> to me, the bottom of jeans is extremely important and you need to be skinny, you don't need to be a flare, and you don't need to be a trumpet. What is this? Skinny jean, trumpet jean. Oh, it's a onesie. You, you didn't know it was a onesie? What did you think it was? Yeah, I didn't think anything. <laughs> <laughs> Why? Hello? This nonsense on the back, I don't know what that is there for. You know when you just get like a breeze, like just chilling your back? Mm. <laughs> this isn't going to keep you warm. Your kidneys are going to be so cold. I don't remember even picking these. Pretending that I'm cool enough to wear jeans like this is like me lying to myself. This is unnecessary. This looks like a genuine my mum's curtain. My mum's curtain in a, in a top. It's $23 for a curtain. No. Look at the cut of them. Why is it a boot cut? This is literally a boot cut. Boot cut is the ugliest. <laughs> cut of jean of all time. Who has boot cut? It's making me angry being here. I look, I look like a rectangle. Kind of fun, like da -da 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 -da. This top was very much a mission to get into. I feel like I'm not even into it yet. This is how bad is wearing mum's curtain. Some of y'all don't even know how to spell curtain. It'll be a pain in the ass if you go to the toilet though. Oh yeah, that's really true. You, oh, you logic, logic, man see, logic. Man logic. If you go to the toilet, you're gonna have to basically de-pant your entire <laughs> outfit. This is giving me a long indenter bum, like. It literally looks like what grandma knitted for Christmas that gets hidden away. No. The shade of brown is a poo brown. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Sorry, let's be professional over here. It actually looks nice on, but this this is one of those items that looks nice from far, but far from nice. You know they have that statement. It looks like um like it's almost made of tissue paper. Yeah. Did you just see that? It's molting on me. I have allergies. I will have allergies. No! It's just molting everywhere. <laughs> so I know this thing is really in trend right now, but it looks ridiculous. I literally look like John Travolta in Grease Lightning. What the heck? You going scuba diving? <laughs> <laughs> I knew you hate this. Basically a wetsuit, 
So for all you people in the market for some snorkeling kit. Uh, 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 uh. No, I look like Elvis. Elvis Presley. I look like an idiot. I literally look like an idiot. It says experience quality, but this is not quality. This is bad. Now, yes, we have a lot of feeding the world going on right about now. Let's just put this plastic dashiki on. It's plastic. This is like, this is not exaggerated shoulder. This is literally spikes on my shoulders. What the hell is this? Woo! <laughs> what is this? Just, just, what is this, man? I look like a crisp packet. What the heck is, pew, 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 pew. I literally can shoot someone. The fact that they've made this out of plastic, right? The fact that it is fake dashiki print. And the fact that we have a tail. We actually have a tail. These rich ones will literally take your eye out. These are daggers. Look at me from the side, literally. Who am I? Parallelogram. In this mirror, I look an idiot. Like an actual idiot. Like, where are you going with your ill-made t-shirt and your cape? Why is there a cape? Why is it okay but the back of this? This number here is a bit of a, you know, leave your hopes and dreams at the door and just bring your nudity in. Do it for the culture. <laughs> Do it for the culture. <laughs> and we're back in Doris territory. With the pearls. I didn't choose the Doris life. The Doris life chose me. I've literally gone from flipping Doris to Black China. This is made out of the same material that they make tents out of. You know when you get a blow up tent? This, same material, don't know what they call it. Any foul move and all my organs are out. You have to be confident to walk in like this, like, robot. Do I look down with the kids? Down with the kick. <laughs> it smells like a man's gym kit. We're nips, we're fanny, we're everything. We're, everything is to the wind, life is to the wind. It looks like a scarecrow outfit. It goes from casual to like, swag. 30 pounds for, for half the material. Wow, looks nice. It literally looks like what it looks like in the images, right? But just on arrival, it's just, it's a bin liner. It's a ripped bin liner. It's a bin liner with the rips at the back. I'm giving myself John Travolta. I don't even have. look like I should be part of the Amish, like. If you want to hair flip like Beyonce, people love using Beyonce's name in vain. Stop it! What the hell is this dress? This looks like the church dresses my mum used to put me in as a kid that I would literally cry about wearing. Have a look at the back. The back is why I bought it. I thought the back looked cute, but the front, I look like a nun. This has got no swag. This is just grotesque. My hairline looks like it has been drawn with a protractor. If you're someone like me who can't dance, this can give you the illusion of being able to move sexily because it does all the movement for you. But this is literally orange, an orange bin liner. This is awful. Other than the fact that it keeps kind of twirling and twisting on the ends and you are going to have to be basically attached to a brush to not look like a bird's nest. I think the style is really nice. To me, this is actually really, really good. Semi-circle hairline or not? Oh, where are you up to today? Just going to get on my horse. Like, I swear, I feel like I need a horse and a cart. I am a cat woman in this stage. Cat women with breasts. If you don't have breasts, this is gonna give you breasts. Semi-circle edges for the wing. Look at that oval. You can place an egg right here. This is a 100% what were you thinking kind of outfit. What were you thinking? It's literally looking like an old school Tesco carrier bag. If you're hungry, I can feed the world with the village feeders right about now. Oh, this one looks like ramen noodles. Ramen noodles. The V is so low. You do not need to literally see the top of my vagina. I kind of a little bit like Catwoman in this, like... Catwoman. Grandma's tablecloth was a trend. This would be the trend. This is what you'd be wearing. Wear grandma's tablecloth out 
this is the dress you end up with. Like, this isn't just a slit. This is literally a gaping hole. Oh, oh! I look like a cartoon character. We need them with their market employ. It's such a market employ when they tell us it was this price and now it is this price. Where was it that price? Because I never saw it and I would have never paid that price for it. Supposedly it's got 56% off. Supposedly it was $47.99, but you know no one was spending $47.99 ever for this. There's a lot of breasticles, there's a lot of boobage. These are what they call grown ass baby hairs. In person they give me Edward Scissor hand vice. And it looks alright, but at the front here I've literally got a baggy fanny. I hate when trousers do that. This one looks quite Halloween-y. My leg looks like a chicken thigh. What is this? It just looks very white bin liner. I mean, I'm gonna try it on, let's see. Oh, this is, oh, this is Poverino. Poverino. It's just, it's just so white, girls. It's just so white. I just look like I made a mistake in life. Like, this actually looks like a school project. Like, this is a year six primary school project. I made a shirt. Why is this curving under my eye? Like it's literally fits right under my eye. No, this is some ergonomics going on. This is literally going right in here. I like that, but I don't think it's a bad jumper and I love the back, but your kidneys are definitely gonna get cold in this. But who needs kidneys, hey? Oh my gosh. This skirt is nice. No, that skirt is rude. How can you be so rude? How can you be so rude? And you're only $13. It was an attempt at being conservative. It's almost like they give with one hand. We have our boobs covered up and take with the other. The bottom is particularly short and the back is particularly, particularly nude. This is some woman like me, woman like me. <laughs> It's a woman like me. <laughs> what? Okay, you don't need a lot of this. Patricia's got to rectify. Patricia has got to. Uh, I will, and you need to be confident in the product. Get, be cocky and just go in there with your brush because you will look like this. I actually just have had to baby wipe that away. We're just going to literally kiss, kiss this. This is that obvious pleather and it's literally glistening like the sun. Literally, bin liner, why? Why is it so shiny? What do I do with the rest of this? What am I gonna do, like tie a bow here? Wrap me up like a Christmas present. Oh, this could be nice for Valentine's Day though. <laughs> Now, it either looks like I've tried to customise a bin liner, but like it's, I've done a good job. I was dissing the bin liner out of the bag, but it looks good, doesn't it? It's literally, pew, hello world, I have arrived. These ones are clearly arriving for the whole world to see, so we're just going to censor. It's giving me a little Michael Jackson. You got to be stunning some. You got to be stunning something. I don't mind showing a little cleavage, but when you can literally see your milk duct is doing the most. Oh. Oh my gosh. Oh, my, with the shirt and the hair, I could be a sophisticated school teacher. I'm not really sure this kind of chewed up by a dog effect we have going on on the bottom here. Why did we need to do it? Maybe if I got a bigger size, I could get more coverage on this as well. Get, you know, the nipple that's about to fly out, you know, get that situated effectively. I'm feeling sexy. Oh, yes. Okay, Patricia, we're going from school teacher to go about town. I don't know if it's a bit much for a wedding though, because it's there's a lot of like openness. I think we just need to just de-open it. Like it shouldn't be so open. We're, we are deep V, but we aren't deep V. We literally feel like Auntie Dorothy. But just down here, we're Doris. To up here, we're action. The arms are just giving me Giddy up cowboy, just giddy up cowboy. Unfortunately, I've just seen this top and I don't know what I was thinking because it looks like ba like early baby poo, like the colour is just off key. I thought I was Lewis Hamilton. Why have I got these? Yeah, I'm definitely wearing it the wrong way around because it's just giving me literal baggy fanny. <laughs> is this the front? Is this the back? 
Should I have a bum here? Literally a bum fanny right here. Hugh Hefner with some bling. That's what I'm getting with these. Okay. Booty coming through. <laughs> Why did I pick this, Patricia? Looks like it's been chewed up by a dog. <laughs> this looks like a shirt. You know, a racer vest for some guy, right? <laughs> When the expectation is so far from the reality. <laughs> so I just went. I didn't buy that. I did. But this 